Welcome to DMZ channel. This is the bio of Spice. Enjoy this video. In this video, we are going to talk about biography of Spice. So before starting this video, please like this video and subscribe to our channel for the future updates. Spice, whose real name is Grace Latoya Hamilton, born August 6, 1982, is a Jamaican dancehall music singer, actress, and businesswoman. Spice, also referred to as the Queen of Dancehall, is one of the most well-known dancehall performers in the world. She is renowned for her forceful pace, diverse musical taste, and blunt lyrics. Spice originally achieved popularity in 2000 after appearing at the yearly dancehall festival Sting. For record producer Dave Kelly's Madhouse Records, she debuted with the song Complain in 2003. She continued to release the singles Right There and Hype, and in 2004 and 2006, she appeared on songs by Jimmy Cliff and Beanie Man, respectively. Spice achieved her first significant success in 2009 with the contentious single Romping Shop with Vibes Cartel. Her debut EP, So Me Like It, 2014, which was preceded by the single of the same name, was later released after she signed with VP Records. Spice was the first female dancehall musician to ever be nominated for Best Reggae Act at the 2016 MOBO Awards and the only female to be nominated in the category overall. She participated regularly in the cast of the VH1 reality series Love and Hip Hop, Atlanta, which portrayed her efforts to take her music career to a global level. Captured, 2018, a mixtape that served as Spice's first full-length record, was independently published and debuted at the top of the Billboard Reggae Albums chart. At the 64th Grammy Awards in 2022, her long-delayed debut studio album, 10, 2021, was nominated for Best Reggae Album. After leaving VP, she self-published her second studio album, Emancipated, 2022, on her own label, Spice Official Entertainment. In September 2023, she also released the deluxe edition of that album. Career When Spice was granted the chance to play at the yearly dancehall event Sting in 2000, she made her stage debut. Her first significant performance on a stage show resulted in multiple encore requests from the audience. Despite not having any hit records at this point in her career, Spice managed to establish a name for her theatrical presence. Spice and Vibes Cartel, a fellow dancehall musician, worked together on the song Romping Shop, which included a sample of Nayo's Miss Independent. The song had extensive rotation on U.S. major urban radio stations and swiftly gained notoriety throughout the world. The song Romping Shop peaked at number 76 and stayed 15 weeks on the Billboard Hot R&B Hip Hop Songs chart. Spice and VP Records entered into a recording agreement. She issued the single Jim Screechy in 2010. She released a remix of her song Fun in 2011 that included the rapper Missy Elliott. The single Take Him Out from Lost Sixth Album Kiss. Keep It Sexy and Simple was co-written by them played the song that year at Reggae Sumfest. In 2012, a music video for Take Him Out was made available. The Gal Click Rhythm, Spice's debut production, was made up of some of her fellow female dancehall musicians. She co-wrote the song Only Ting Me Want with dancehall musician Alkaline in September. With the publication of her single, So Me Like It, later that year, she garnered even more notoriety. With over 114 million views as of 2023, the accompanying music video which was uploaded in January 2014 became the most watched music video on YouTube by a female Jamaican artist. Five songs make up the EP, including Vibes Cartel's Conjugal Visit, So Me Like It, and Like a Man. Within a single day, the Conjugal Visit music video received over 2 million views on World Star Hip Hop, and as of 2023, it had amassed over 100 million views. Spice was the first female dancehall musician to ever be nominated for Best Reggae Act at the MOBO Awards, where she was the only female nominee. The single sheet by Spice was released. 
She made an appearance on the remix of You Don't Know Me by Jax Jones in June. She appeared on Charlie Sloth's I Can Do from his album The Plug in August together with Sean Kingston and Lady Lesher. Spice joins the cast of VH1's reality series Love and Hip Hop, Atlanta as a regular in season 7 after having a cameo appearance in season 6. On November 2, 2018, Spice's debut mixtape, Captured, was made available via her own independent record company, Spice Official Entertainment. After a legal battle with her record label over the release of her long-delayed first album, the mixtape was made available. The Billboard Reggae Albums Chart's number one position was held by Captured. Shaggy served as executive producer on Spice's debut studio album, which was just released. On December 18, 2020, Friends, the album's lead single, was made available on streaming services. On April 30, 2021, Shaggy and Sean Paul's song Go Down Dare was made available as the second lead single from the album. The music video for the song swiftly surpassed millions of views, making the song popular on streaming services. Spice's departure from VP Records was confirmed by Shaggy. She then made a release announcement for Emancipated, her second studio album. On July 22, 2022, the album's lead single, Clap Clap, was released. Spice posted a brief excerpt of the uncut music video for Tape Measure, the second single from the album, on Twitter on August 25, 2022. The video soon gained popularity because to its gruesome imagery. She was a part of the The Fine Nine remix remix of Little Miss by Skang and Nicki Minaj in October, which also included Destra Garcia, Pampudi, Lisa Mercedes, London Hill, Lady Lesher, Dovey Magnum, and Patrice Roberts. Spice returned to social media after experiencing a health scare in November, and on March 14, 2023, she released images on her Twitter and Instagram that showed she was pregnant. These images rapidly went viral in the next few hours. Before the March 17th release of her single God A Bless Me and the accompanying music video, in which she celebrated her rebirth following her hiatus, there had been persistent online rumors about whether she was pregnant. Spice was present at the first ever Caribbean Music Awards on September 1, 2023, at Brooklyn's King's Theatre. She received nominations for Performer of the Year, Dancehall, Female Artist of the Year, Dancehall, and Album of the Year, Dancehall, the latter of which was for her sophomore album Emancipated. Spice beat out other well-known female musicians in the genre, such as Shinsia, Steflon Don, and Jada Kingdom, to win Female Artist of the Year. Later, she announced that her longtime Buddy Vibes cartel had won Artist of the Decade. He accepted the award in an Instagram post in which he also paid tribute to the other nominees in the category Spice and Bounty Killer. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoy this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.